create desert sands next week. So that means it's the big scramble to get our kids back into a healthy schedule. And that means their lunch. I'm joined by a woman who's amassed a large following on Instagram, packing delicious, nutritious lunches for everyone. And she has an app for that. I'm joined by Jillian Fine from La La Lunchbox. Good morning, Jillian. Hi, how are you? Good, good, good. Thank you for waking up with us. Um, so first we're going to, you're going to feature one of your favorite easy lunches for our kids. Um, I have my daughter's lunchbox right here. She hasn't used it yet because she hasn't gone to preschool just yet. Um, and then I have the bento box here too. So okay. I'm going to demonstrate it along with you. Terrific. Okay, there we go. There you go. So let's, let's begin. What are we going to do? Okay, so today we're making tortellini kebabs, and I love these because they're easy to make, they're fun to eat for the kids, mm -hmm. and um, the lunchroom is a social place. So yeah, as yeah. long as it's delicious and easy for the kids to eat and mm -hmm. fun, mm -hmm. um, it's a win in my book. Um, okay. Kebabs, tortellini kebabs are also a fantastic way to get more vegetables into the lunchbox, which I'm always a fan of. Yeah. So... We're gonna do these together, but I've made a couple in advance. And you can see. Oh, okay, so we do it that way. Now I do have to admit that I didn't make the tortellinis yet because um, I'm a That's okay, we're gonna do it together. I okay. just wanted to show you what I have. Perfect. So, I, well, I'm so, saying that I didn't cook them yet because I'm a little busy on a morning show, so. I totally understand. <laughs> I totally understand. Okay. So, so, so food on a stick is one of my favorite lunchbox hacks. Mm -hmm. And, um, handheld anything like finger food related is mm -hmm. perfect for little kids and for big kids so yeah, yeah. i have i have an elementary school kid a middle school kid and a high school kid oh wow you covered and it they, all <laughs> and they all agree yeah food on a stick is food awesome on a stick. so okay. my preference is these lollipop sticks yeah. but really any stick will do mm -hmm. and this is what i'm going to be using today so if you just want to take your stick mm -hmm. and you can just line it up however you want right oh, so i yeah. slid on one tortellini and then i'm gonna add some color with a little baby tomato okay look at me i'm like puncturing there's so me. much variety you can mm -hmm. do with these kinds of kebabs and that's part of what i love about it so you can add a bit of extra flavor with a fresh basil leaf um, I didn't have today. basil, so I, but that sounds amazing. I love basil with the, they didn't have it at the store when I went yesterday. So let me see. Okay. okay we got that's tomato. okay. Mm -hmm. the, the thing about these is they're, they're totally variable and you can do whatever you want. So today I'm also adding some fresh mozzarella and you can use the balls. You can use, you know, a different kind of cheese if you prefer that. Perfect. But I'm just kind of layering it on yeah. like this. What um, what I love too about your um, Instagram, I know I have some video if we can play that of her Instagram account. Um, what I love about that is that it's so colorful and you have so many of these ideas on there, things that you would never think about. Um, and then for this lunch, you, this is like one of your more popular ones with the tortellini and the cheese. Is there anything, uh, what, what's the good side for this? I know I brought a bunch of fruit here. <laughs> So yeah, so the best side. Yeah, so um, I mean, we eat with our eyes, right? Yeah. So mm -hmm. I, I like to focus on things that are really colorful. And mm -hmm. today for this lunchbox, I'm going to be packing uh, some grapes. Oh, yeah, grapes. And some blueberries. And I'm going to show you one of my most beloved mm -hmm. sides um, for really any lunchbox. It's not just about this one. Oh. But I have a banana. Uh -huh. And, um, you know, you could do this with a fresh yellow banana or any kind of banana but uh -huh. i just cut it in half yeah right and then i'm going to take a sharp knife and i'm going to make a little v in it hold on i get around to show you so i've cut out a little yeah. bit of the peel uh -huh. with a sharp knife yeah and i'm going to take a few chocolate chips oh, which are always appreciated uh -huh. from my kids and i'm going to use the the sharp side, uh -huh. the pointy side, uh -huh. and I'm going to place them into the banana uh -huh. like this. And when you're done, it kind of looks like a tuxedo, right? Oh yeah, oh cute. Yeah, you could totally dress up the banana no matter what you do. I don't have a knife with me. 
<laughs> but I can do that right. right here. No, that's awesome. Okay, so that's <clears throat> the banana. And then also blueberries. Um, what I love, too, about some of um, these bento boxes, too, is my daughter was so thrilled when she saw this because I said, look at you could put dip in here because she loves ranch Absolutely. or like if you like uh, ketchup or um, I'm trying to think what else. I can't think on the fly. But any any dip you can put there too. And all these things I too lo I love that your um, you also have an app too. Um, I do. And yeah. I love that because can you explain why you started this app? It's fascinating. Oh yeah. So I mean, I started it just on paper as a project with my with my daughter who's now 15, and um, I launched the app because. It was a paper project and mm -hmm. it went so well with my daughter for preschool that um, a lot of her friends' parents were asking me to replicate the paper that I had created so that she and I could choose lunches together. Mm -hmm. And on the paper, I had designed it with protein, fruit, vegetable, and snack. And um, it was just a process that worked and I launched it into an app. And um, that was 11 years ago. So it's, wow. been, it's been amazing. It's been quite a run. Awesome. And, um, yeah, the purpose of the app is to make lunch planning and lunch packing much easier for parents. Mm -hmm. And it um, is. What it I is. have found. It's like a I game, found, yeah, for the kids. Yeah, so it's like a fun, simple environment for kids. It's very visual and it brings some food ideas that would not otherwise be top of mind into their thinking. So, um, what I love about it is that I'm always in control over what's available for my kids to choose and they get to exercise some voice, right? Mm -hmm. So they feel empowered about what they're bringing for lunch and that excitement makes them much more likely to actually eat their lunch. And there's really few things worse than having a cranky, hungry kid at the end of the school day yeah. and all of the food in the lunchbox that's wasted and has to be thrown out. So I love that. For and us, it, this has worked beautifully. Yeah. No, I love it. It's a beautiful app and you can download it. It's called Long Long Lunchbox. In the meantime, though, I've um, packed my meteorologist, uh, my meteorologist, <laughs> as if I own him. Um, I, we packed him his own lunch. Look at that. But you have to follow Yay. Jillian's account. It is La La Lunchbox. You can see it there at the bottom of your screen. Um, she just has so many great, fun ideas, lots of dietary uh, adjustments you can make if you've got a kid with an allergy. I just love it so much. Um, there's so many ways to incorporate vegetables, fruit. Um, it's so good. Even Mike loves it, as I said. So mm -hmm. even though he was eating raw tortellini during yeah, the break, I was say. like, excuse me, sir, what are you eating? And he goes, raw tortellini. So there you go. <laughs> Uh, we love it. Can what? you eat raw tortellini? I don't know. You might be regretting that later. <laughs> or it might be you know, something else you ate. I don't know. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Jillian. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so yeah, much for having you. me. Absolutely. So check her out, Lala Lunchbox, and we will be right back. <laughs>